guys, welcome back to What Would Dare You Wear. I just wanted to do a short video on a finger comber wig that I received. It's the Kinky Curl Out LS unit. Um, so it's gonna be a little choppy because I had to film a video in the car when I had it on. So um, stay tuned. So I just wanted to do a short video while in the car. First time for everything. <laughs> um, so I just took my braids out last night and I'm getting a sew in today. Um, and the wig that I'm wearing, it's a finger comber wig, you know, my faves. It's the elongated curl fro, fro curl, elongated fro curl, um, wig. So this to me is a shorter version of the kinky curl out unit. And then the, what is the name of it? The honeycomber. Like this is the short and then those two fall in line after this is longer. So um, I like it because it definitely looks like it's my hair. And my coworkers won't even know the difference because tomorrow I'll be in there with some different hair, but they won't know the difference. Um, I like it because it does look like my hair. Easy to blend, of course. Um, but yeah, I definitely would order this wig again. You, you guys know my spiel on finger comber units. They're just really convenient. Like, you need to get one. Like, just to have. You need to have a few that you can just throw on when you're annoyed with flat ironing, ironing your hair. Or doing your hair in general. Because all you need to do is flat twist. And then throw the thing on in the morning. So, definitely love it. Looks natural. Convenient. I'll talk more later. <laughs> All right. So as you saw, the wig looked really good on. It kind of reminded me of a shorter version of my regular kinky curl out unit. And then the finger comber, the honeycomber is the longer, the long version. It's the longest I've had. The kinky curl out is a you know, a medium version, kind of similar to this length of this, this weave that I'm wearing now. And then the LS is, is shorter. So this is what it looks like. Of course, really full. The curls look good. I only, I literally, literally only wore it, um, for a couple hours. I wore it to work and then I had to go get my hair done that same day. So really pretty has the comb at the top and the comb at the bottom with the adjustable straps. And I did the same thing. I just flat twisted just a little bit of my hair in the front so that I could blend it easily um, and just threw it on. Again, convenience. Summertime is about to get hot or it's hot some places in the East Coast, but we gotta go get on California. Um, so you need something that you could just throw on. Um, I definitely recommend finger comber wigs. I've tell, I've been telling you guys this for months. This is like my second full year wearing them or, you know, so it's not like I'm just trying to sell y'all on something I'm not using. I'm using them. Right now I'm wearing a sew-in only because I just, I, I wanted to put my hair up all the way. I didn't even want to have to do the on and off, but I still root for these wigs because I wear them like and I'm obviously I'm keeping them together in their box all stored nicely so once I come out of this I'm gonna throw it right back on I'm just in and out of protective styles right now because I want my hair to keep on growing nice and healthy and thick um but just to compare this is the kinky curl out unit so this is the step up this is the longer version of the ls so it's a little longer. Yeah, she a little dusty because this is <laughs> this is my top knot wig, as you can see. Um, but you can tell how much longer this is. So the curls are a little tighter over here, longer and a little looser. Obviously, I've had her for longer than this, but as you can see, this is the kinky curl out is longer here is the kinky curl out ls unit 
So if you're going for, if you want a more natural, anything that's closer to your actual length of hair or what your hair would look like if you were wearing like a wash and go or something, definitely go with this one. This one, I like long, big hair. So I'll, I'll go for either one. But if, if this is the look you're going for, something that actually looks like your hair, or depending on what your length of hair is, go with the Kinky Curl Out LS unit. Um, that's pretty much it. I pretty, I, I, I feel like I outlined as much as I could about this wig um, because I talked so much about them in my other videos. So if you are interested or you have any questions, definitely shoot me a comment or message me on Instagram and I'll help as much as I can. Um, but there's tons of wigs on fingercomber.com, tons. I even seen one today when I was just was on the website, a wash and go unit. That might be my next one. That might be my next one. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. Really short and to the point. And I hope you have a great day. See you soon.